Once upon a time, there was a boy and a girl in a town of constant traditions and plans. The town of Nazareth, it's where our story unfurls before the Son of God came as a man. This Son of God, yet fully man, he came to bridge this broken land. He'd live and he'd teach for 30 years. He'd break your bread and he'd shed your tears. He'd climb the mountain and mount the cross. He'd overcome what had looked like a loss, but this is not quite the tale of him. No, you've heard his story there and back again today. We're here to fill in the gaps, to set the before and to look to the past that these two young lovers who weren't asking for more when I came banging down their door. We'll start at the end so you'll know where we land before we go to the beginning and carry on as planned. You'll meet a young girl with her whole life ahead of her, full of her own dreams and desires. And you'll meet a man unique and true, did his best when his life came unglued but don't for a moment think they're stuck in the past. Consider how many of you know what it's like to be an outcast. They lived in a time not kind to their situation. The people in their town cast judgment with elation. So let's step into Nazareth, meet the people, know the place. I'll be with you through it and I'll help set the pace. Bring the lights up on this town. Our story starts here and just like I told Mary, you have nothing to fear. A smudge on the map, stuck in the past, a dot on the grid. For a laugh I come in at last It is what it is Maybe it's weird Maybe we're odd Call it a home The way over here The Romans Thank God. God Just leave us alone Everyone else, you follow the rules, the don'ts and the do's, don't, don't embarrass, embarrass yourself. Upset. She doesn't get it. They've always lived here. If you had your chance up in Damascus, why would you not? I've said it before. I'd rather be poor than work a government job. Empty wishes never make you happy. I'm 
Nazareth was an old place, families bound by tradition's rules, a place where slow was the only pace, where tradition made daughters into wives in exchange for a mule. Well, I must say, you just seem lovely and so grounded in your family. You must have good stability in tent making. Oh, oh yes, yes. My, my grandfather was a tent maker, and, and my father was a tent maker, and, and, and I'm a tent maker, and, and someday my son will, will be a tent maker. S sorry, that's, I could talk about tent making all day, but that's, that's not why I came here today. Um, I am prepared to provide very fair compensation for your daughter. Ugh. Perhaps you'd like to meet Mary first. Oh, oh no, that's quite okay. That, that's fine, sir. It's no you. problem. She's just no, outside. No, 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 really, sir. I have no desire to speak with a girl. Uh, this is just a simple business transaction, uh, an exchange of goods. Well, perhaps we all better think about it a little bit more. Okay. Thank you very much for coming by. Mary, can't you stay silent for once? I don't know how many men you think there are in Nazareth, but at this point, you'll sooner wind up with a cow than a husband. Oh, please, Mama. He wasn't exactly a knight in shining armor. Pardon me for not swooning into his arms at the mention of an exchange of goods. Don't you take that tone with me, Mary. Oh, Papa. You know our customs as well as any other girl in Nazareth. Oh, come on. Now, both of you, please. It'll all be okay. No, you don't know that. It's easy for you to say, Mary, when I was your age, it's not like we all want the same things. Would you give me a say for a change? I know you care about me, you're trying, no doubt, but for crying out loud, I'm 16. It'll all be okay. Well, that's easy for you to say. We're talking about the rest of my life here. I'm young, 16. I think I got some time. Hoping I could wait for the right year. Someone at least. I'd like to meet a guy who's smart and not so creepy who will look in my eyes. Wouldn't hurt if he was tall and dreamy, but I'd settle for regular size. And that's easy for you to say. I was married when I was your age. Believe me, there's no Okay? Well, that's easy for you to say. What's the point of all of the hurry? Hold up, slow down, look at the pros and cons. Gonna have to give me a dowry. And that alone, think of how much it costs for the goats and sheep and cattle and all of the stuff. Oh, and a fancy wedding feast for daddy. He already works hard enough. It's easy for you to say. If you want to be an old maid, I'm waiting for love. Oh, whatever. You should wake up before it's too late. I'm standing around while you're turning men down for crying out loud you're 16. You'll have your day. That's easy for you to say. Wait, listen to you. Yeah, well, maybe you should. Girls. I'm Mary. I'm so mature. Come on, that's not fair. I'm taking my time. My tastes are refined. Excuse me for wanting something more with my life. I know what you mean, but take it from me. It's easy for 
Fine. Then take your sister to the market. We're nearly out of wine. Lord knows it's needed. Nazareth was a small town. Everybody knew everybody else. And Nazareth, it was a close town. And Mary, she'd fallen for someone in spite of herself. Yeah, we still got enough time today to get it done, I think. We get that beam in right over here, guys. That's we can't get that. Leave it right there. Thank you. I'll by the end of the day. I adjusted these a little bit. You got it upside down. Cool. All right. Hey, boys. Oh, no. Hey. Oh, hey, Mary. Hey. Joanna. Don't worry, boys. Mary has once again rejected the man with a cold heart of somebody doomed to be an old maid. <laughs> Joanna, you can't talk about people behind their back when they're standing right in front of you. That's not how gossiping works. No, no, I'm no gossiper. I'm just a... Verbal processor. I take it another one didn't pass the test? Oh, please, there's not a test. <laughs> oh, if there's no test, how come everyone keeps failing? Well, I just have a certain idea for my life that no one's quite managed to capture yet. Oh, sure, right. I'm sure your parents are thrilled. Oh, you know them? I've never seen a more jovial pair. Cheer up, kid. It won't always be like this. What you doing? Hey, Ace! What are you doing out here? Oh, I just needed some fresh air. Need a hand? <laughs> you want to help? <laughs> yeah, sure, why not? I could use a hand. Oh, man. Can I ask you a question? Uh, that is a question. Come on, I'm being serious. Do you ever get tired of this? Of this work? Not particularly. Of this town on occasion, but what's not to love about a town full of busybodies content to watch you fail? Did you ever get tired of the looming threat of some unfortunate looking husband? Please, it's not like you're any help with that anyway. Careful, Mary, you'll give a guy the wrong idea. Wrong idea? I'm giving you the right idea. <laughs> Well, it looks like your sister's over there planning an idea with the entire workforce in Nazareth. Oh, I better get her back before I'm returning with a half dozen potential brothers in the... I'll see you, Joe. Joanna. See you later. <laughs> Knock it off! <laughs> hey, you can't blame us. We're just making an observation. Yeah, it's just simple. Keep your observations to yourselves. Mary and I... Oh, here he goes. <laughs> oh, are you in for one? Hey. Hey, all right. Mary, she is a catch. Well, yeah, she would be if she'd let anyone catch her. What? Oh. I didn't say she's not wonderful. We work in her chatting over here, guys. Ugh, I'm going to be honest with you, boss. It's a bit of both. Uh, Joe's been talking a lot about Mary. Yeah, I'm not really sure how much work he's going to be getting done today. We may as well just call it a day right now. Oh, come on, guys. Give me a break. Hey, we're not blaming you, man. Yeah, we've all been there with some girl or other. Right, boss? Take lunch, guys. <laughs> That's what I thought. Construction. It's a complicated thing Mostly it takes longer than you think Sometimes a little month turns into two or three or four Sometimes little things turn into more You wind up with a batch of broken bricks Or find a patch you have to stop and fix 
Sometimes you make adjustments just because you're bored. Boy, sometimes little things turn into more. Oh, 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 hey, and that's a fact. Oh, 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 oh hey, the fact is. Sometimes the calculations will confuse you to the core. Okay. Sometimes little things turn into more. Oh, 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 oh hey, that's a fact. Oh, 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 hey, the fact is that. Oh, 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 hey, you can't ignore that sometimes a little thing turn into more. I improvise a plans, meeting expectations and demands, but you never promise anything at all until you're sure, sometimes little things turn into more. since the beginning of time, and our Mary and Joe were no different at all. It was a friendship that slowly started to climb, no matter how long Joseph stammered and stalled. There's a nervous excitement at the edge of the unknown where anything seems possible before the story's been told. Once upon a time, there was a girl and a boy, and let's watch how they fell without even trying. Looks good. What's next? Uh, next, we're bringing another beam in and then uh, lunch, hopefully. And then after lunch? Uh, then back to work. Come on, don't you ever think a little farther beyond that? Lunch, work, wife, family? Mary, what did I say about wrong ideas? Don't kid with me. I'm not. You've had plenty of better offers than me, even I know that. Better than you, how? You know what I mean. Look, they're in one door and out the other. When I see you, it's just... Point is, I'm not interested in them. I'm interested in you. If you can't see that or you don't want that, then just tell me. Mary, I don't have a business. I don't have lineage in Nazareth. 
I don't know how I to tell you. I don't care about any of that. Just try. Any ordinary guy wants a wife, some kids, a family. I always figured that a time would come. Give it all an honest try It makes sense just talking practically I never thought that I would fall in love <sighs> There, I said it I'm sorry No, Mary, I'm not sorry at all I meant it I'm only sorry it took me this long You are the only thing that slows the world down I'm held in your gravity You are the waking dream that turns me around And promises everything bright you can see a future with me. Any ordinary guy wouldn't strike me as that interesting. Joseph, I've been down that road before. strong and kind, the kind of man that I found you to be. That's no ordinary guy for sure. So you love me? You're surprised. Oh Mary, this is wonderful news. You love me. Yes, I love you. Oh, Mary, I love you too. You are the only thing that's down. Down, down, held in your gravity. You are the waking dream that turns me around and promises everything by there. Sorry, story of us that will we'll ride together. A beautiful story that's never been told. And how could the story of anyone's life be better with some? Mary and I have decided... Oh my gosh, you're engaged! <laughs> <laughs> really? Oh my, oh my, oh Mary! <laughs>
Ah, the thrill of young love can last a long time, but there was a different plan for Mary and Joe. Their love shoved into trial and forced to survive, beginning with a certain angel named Gabriel sent down below. Get to go to Earth today. Where is she, Mary? Oh, there she is. Oh. Oh, hi. oh, I'm so sorry. My goodness. Didn't see you there, oh. Mary. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> sorry, have we met? Not technically. Not yet, but first. Allow me to wish you the most sincere congratulations on your betrothal. Oh, no. Okay. Um, how did you know? That? Oh, I have to say, Mary, it is quite the honor to have this opportunity to share such amazing news with you. What news? <laughs> what news? Only the greatest news the world will ever know. The truth humanity has been waiting for since the dawn of time. The news about him coming down. Oh, here. Uh, what I'm trying to say is I've been sent here to deliver you a message dictated to me by my boss. Nothing. Okay. Hi. 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 <laughs> Hi, I'm gonna start over. My name is Gabriel, and I've been sent here by God to deliver you a message. Wow. It's right here. It's gonna be good. Ah, here we go. First of all, hello. You are highly favored. You are not alone. In fact, I know you, and I like you very much. A joke, you can't be serious. You're telling me this letter that you're reading is the word of God. Word of God? Yeah. Would you relax? Where was I? Oh yeah. You are highly favored, yada yada yada. Oh, I like you very much. Here it is. Here is the best part. So have a seat and pay attention. This is quite important. You are highly favored, you'll conceive and have a baby And you'll call the baby Jesus and he'll be the son of God He'll be great and wonderful and God will give to him the throne of David And he'll reign forevermore and his kingdom will not end What? How can this happen? I am a... I never even, you know what I mean. And I'm engaged, like to be married. Are you mistaken? Cause this really seems impossible. Nothing is impossible if it's the will of God. His spirit will come over you and you will be with child. Your relative Elizabeth is pregnant at her age. She was barren, listen Mary. His plans never fail. I have no words. I am God's servant. If this is really what you say it is, then May it be fulfilled. Mary, don't be afraid. The Lord is very fond of you. I'm trying to get this straight. You've somehow decided to claim the No, oh, I know. It sounds crazy. <laughs> I crazy. know. That is the understatement of the century. This will ruin us, Mary. This will ruin you. I mean, it doesn't have to ruin the whole family. Hush, Joanna. Explain it to me again. There is nothing for her to explain. This isn't some miracle. 
She hasn't been approached by an angel. She wasn't chosen by God. Mama. No, no, no. What this is, is a mistake. You cannot wish or hope or dream yourself out of this, Mary. Oh, oh, I don't know what you want me to say. Well, say something. What have you told Joseph? I haven't told Joseph. <sighs> okay, well then there's another thing. How do you expect that conversation to go, huh? I mean, Mary could always go live with Elizabeth. I think it's a bit premature to be deciding living situations when we don't even know if she'll be able to walk through town without taking a rock to her head! Oh, Mama! Please, this is no way to ease tensions. <sighs> How often do we say things in haste that when given some thought were perhaps said in poor taste? Well, that's what poor Joanna's about to discover when the tale she told one person had soon spread to another. Good news, it travels fast. But bad news, it travels faster. And the news that I told Mary had already spread past her. Good news, I have bad news. This town is so boring, but I've got a story, it's sad news. Remember that thing in the market last spring that I told you? Oh, is it that good? Oh, it's better, it's worse. Oh, I love bad news. My dear, I've been praying how to handle this well, who to tell if you get what I'm saying. I'm always so careful oh, I know. about my reputation But I've held it inside for like days and my nerves are all fraying Oh, if I got no one to blame, no reason to complain Tell me what could be worse Oh, if you got something to say, make it shocking, make it strange Give me the bad news first Other one, she's kind of pretty. She lives over there in the third Dark house hair. with her family. Yeah, I've got her. She's nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very friendly. In fact, as it turns out, our nice, friendly friend is Michelle. We say getting around town. No. Yes. Surely you don't mean. I do. But how did you find out? Oh, sweetie, there's ways. It's not my first day on the playground. Oh, if I got no one to play, no reason to complain. Tell me what could be worse. Oh, if you got something to say, make it shocking, make it strange. Give me the bad news first. This mess, this fiasco, this might just be more than our fine little village can handle. And didn't they just get engaged? Yes, I know. What a scandal. It's a punch in the gut. Oh, that sly little... What a disaster. And they of her family, their girl running wild. A disgrace. With whoever she fancies. Well, they let this happen. Should we do something? Talk to them? Can we? That they would allow this to happen oh. at all is beyond me. Oh, if I got no one to blame. Bad news first. Joe. Joseph, please, I can explain. No, Mary. No, it sounds crazy, I know, and I realize that, but this angel came to me and he said these things, and I Mary, know. Please. Look, this is not how I wanted to have this conversation, Joe. You know I love you. There's no one else. I didn't ask for this. Mary, just stop. You 
are the only thing that slows the world down. I'm held in your gravity. You are the waking dream that turns me around and promises everything bright. If you could see a future with me. She can't stay here. I'm sure we can come up with a solution that works Oh, don't be foolish. She simply cannot stay here. Already this shame is hot on the whole town's lips, and it will only get worse from here. Mary's tough. You think Mary is the only one facing whispers in the street? You would subject your whole family to the constant ridicule? And if that doesn't convince you, I'm certain you've realized it is not safe for her. Mama, this is my home. And it always will be. But your mama is right. It's not safe here in Nazareth. That's not true. I just need to talk to Joseph. Mary, Joseph doesn't want to talk to you. No, he just needs time. I know it's hard, baby, but someday you'll understand. Why would you even have me go? Nazareth is all I've ever known. Well, you've always wished for more. Maybe this is your chance to have it. Your cousin Elizabeth, I'm sure she'll take you in. It'll be better for you to be with family at this time anyway. <laughs> you are my family. Yes, Mary, and we love you immensely. But at Elizabeth's, you'll be away from all this. And I'm sure it's the best decision for all of us. And it won't be forever. You'll be home soon. The time will pass quickly. It won't be forever. Won't be forever. What am I supposed to think, supposed to do? A girl like me, no, seriously, I kinda had a plan and it did not include a baby now, a husband first, that'd be good, I'm sorry God, it's just, well, it's a lot, who am I to question it if it's from you? mean no disrespect don't get me wrong but am i really who you meant to choose an ordinary nobody to tell the truth i think i am maybe not cut out for this all i can see is all my hopes scattering all of my dreams Disappear like autumn leaves And all of my soul Is desperate for the courage to believe And all I can say Is help me God If it's really you Show me your favor I'm willing but I'm so afraid To face this alone I just don't Could I tell Joseph and my family? You know that legend from the past The prophets told it's come to pass Guess what? It's me An angel told me so Come on! Who would believe? And since they don't, what's next? What happens now? Forgive me if I seem ungrateful with these doubts For if I disappoint you But I'm overwhelmed, it's just so much to think about 
to have a child and raise it. God, I don't know how. I'm here and I'm your servant, but I'm scared. And all I can see are miles of fears in front of me. All I can hear are questions and uncertainties. And all of my plans suddenly are slipping out of reach. And all I can say is help me, God, if it's really you. Show me your favor. I'm willing, but I'm so afraid to face this alone. I just don't think that I could be that brave. Can you make me brave? Will you make me brave? destiny and future after all you are God and who am I to tell you what to do and all I can say is help me Lord if I found favor show me your grace I'm willing but I'm so afraid to face this alone I need your strength How could she do this? What kind of fool does she think that I am? How could she put me through this? Betray me with some other man? I never asked for any of this. All the gossip and suspicion. Everybody watching, whispering. God, I miss her, Mary. How could you do this? What kind of fools you think that I am? So, brave Mary left town and left her home. A poor Joseph stayed behind, upset and alone. Nazareth was a small town you only needed to visit once, but it was time for my second trip down to teach poor Joseph how to trust. Tough day. Uh, yeah, you could say that. You want to talk about it? It's uh, kind of a long story. I, I happen to be a pretty good listener. Well, uh, I got notice of a census today. Oh, a census. You have to travel far? That, that can be a pain. No. Uh, yeah. But it's just a trip I figured I'd be making with my wife. We're separated. She's pregnant. And that's a problem because... <laughs> because it's not mine. Oh. Because we're not married yet. Not that we could be now anyways. Not in this town. Mm -hmm. Did you know that she's claiming that the baby is the Messiah? That it's the child of God? And? <laughs> and that's crazy? Okay, but do you believe her? Believe that she's carrying the Son of God? Why would I? 
Why wouldn't you? <laughs> because that's ridiculous. Okay, sure. But has she ever lied to you before? Not until now. Now? Why start now? It makes just as much sense believing she's telling the truth than believing she's telling a lie. Yeah, except it's impossible. Nothing is impossible. You know what? Why don't you sleep on it?
How can it be? How can a hope that died be brought back to life in one night? One dream I should have known. But who did believe it? No one believe it. Who will believe it? People sing angels, hearing messages from God. I must be crazy. But how can we both be crazy? Two simple people, me and her. Our simple corner of the earth. It's complicated, that's for sure. This simple plan to change the world. My reputation, my whole life. I've been the guy who does things right. Keep it simple, it's all the line. Just play it safe and you'll be fine. And now I'm standing on the border, staring into the future. On the edge of letting go, losing control, and I'm touching the face of danger, brushed by the wings of angels, reaching the heavens. Mystery, this destiny. You tell me to take her as my wife, taking this baby as my child. Raise the Messiah, who am I? I only ask for a simple lie. And now I'm standing on the border, staring into the future, here on the edge of letting go. is like the thunder and it's roaring like the sea and it pulls me from my slumber awakens a new dream in me and I'm standing on the board Wings of angels reaching to 
fat. Excuse me. If you feel fat, exactly how am I supposed to feel? I just didn't think it would be like this. <laughs> you didn't expect God to bless you with a divine pregnancy? You know, I would call you crazy. But this particular form of miracle does seem to run in the family. <laughs> Thank goodness it does. Who would ever have thought that you and I would be experiencing pregnancy together? Yeah, like that's the weirdest part of all of this. I have to say, I for one am really glad that you're here, both of you. <laughs> I'm so glad you took us in. I don't know what I would have done if you hadn't. It's so nice just to have someone believe me for a change. You do seem more yourself than you did when you first arrived. Oh, Nazareth feels like a lifetime ago. This has taken everything over. <laughs> it won't always feel like that. I don't know. Maybe we'll just stay like this forever. <laughs> no, 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 no. This particular season has a definite end date to it. Forty weeks and that's the limit. Kick it up, go nuts. You've got one month to lie evict the tenants. Pushing sixty, chasing a kid around. Oh, your foot, stop it. Settle down. Forty weeks feels like forever, like our fathers in the desert, wandering all alone. Took forty years to make it home. Just wait. You're gonna gain like 40 pounds. What? How? I can't even keep my breakfast down. Just take it in and take it easy. This is only for a season. Just wake up every day and believe it. You're all right. You're okay. You'll be fine. Never. Forty years we've been together. All my friends with all their kids. Our neighbors, they have seven. Forty years of waiting for my son. Forty weeks is, it's, it's done. Just any mom. That's true, a miracle of God like you. You will be the mother of a king. So that makes me an awesome, don't you think? Take it in and take it easy. This is only for a season. Wake up every day.
something's going down. Wait, what? I don't know, but there's something Tell happening. Me everything. Saw him running to Mary's house. What? Who? Up the road, he was so. Stop babbling. What did you see? What did you hear? Why did I let her go? Where is he going? Do you I know? I have to bring her home. I don't know, man. It's not like him. Didn't say a word. To not me. to show up and not tell anyone. Right. It's been tough since they called it you gotta off. get to work Had it rough, he was, uh, he was so in love There is somebody at the door Are you sure? Mama's are not expecting anyone Mama Joseph is at Joseph? the door Well, get up, hurry up I wonder what he wants What do you want? What do you mean by this? Please won't you tell me What kind of stunt, what kind of thing is this? Where is my Mary? What do you want? What do you mean by Please this? You Tell me What kind of stunt, what kind of thing is this? Where is she, where is she? I don't see why you need to Everything know. has changed So help me if you meet her anyhow no. no, I swear, but I can't explain it Everything that she said, everything is true Do you think that he seems sincere? I don't know What if he really up. had a change of heart? What if what Mary said was real? Honey, that's enough, but no, Joanna, don't you start what have you done? What do you mean by this? I know this? it sounds crazy to what you. Sort of what kind of plan is crazy. It took him some time, but Joseph finally saw the light. So he left Nazareth to find Mary to set things right. They were beginning a journey without all the answers, but they knew now at last that they were on it together. Mary! What are you doing here? I met him. Who? The angel? My angel? Yes. H how? When? He came to me in a dream, Mary. He turned my whole world upside down. I came as soon as I could. What did he tell you? He told me not to be afraid. Yeah, that's what he told me. He told me that we are to have a son. You look beautiful. Joseph, why are you here? Sorry, I was so afraid. I was afraid too. It just makes me wonder. I wonder why we weren't told at the same time. Why was I left in the dark for so long? Why that town? Of all places, he chooses Nazareth. Yeah, I've wondered that too. Why were we told like this? Why that town? Why us? I don't know. What if we never know? I doubt we will. Why you? Why me? In all the span of history, why here? It isn't like we volunteered for this. I guess it's best that we should have a little faith and trust. Cause we may never, never know, know, but we can wander together. X 
explanation no or have to bend to meet our expectations and i'm confident there's things we'll never know but we can wonder together A promised king, a savior who will free us. It's amazing, crazy, beautiful, mysterious, the, the kind, kind of thing that cannot be explained, but we can wonder together. Once upon a time, there was a boy and a girl, parents to a child who'd one day save the world. Two ordinary people, an extraordinary story, who over the span of history became icons of glory. And just remember, they were people exactly like you. Their decision to trust is one you can make too. They lived and they loved and they doubted as humans. Before you distance yourself from them, take time to zoom in and look at their path. Then look at yours and consider their son who came to settle all scores. And an angel of the Lord appeared to them. And the glory of the Lord shone around them and they were terrified. But the angel said to them, do not be afraid. I bring you good news that will bring great joy to all people. Today, in the town of David, a Savior has been born to you. He is the Messiah, the Lord. 